So my name is Candace Myers and I'm currently an assistant professor at Pennington Biomedical Research Center. The resources that we have access to here as researchers are very appealing and it enables us to really conduct high quality research that has high impact not only on our community in Louisiana but I think also within the United States and internationally as well. My uh, research interests very broadly fit into the title of Social Determinants of Health and Health Disparities. And of course, food insecurity is a very prevalent social issue in Louisiana, but most importantly, it's linked to higher risk for obesity. What people eat, how they purchase foods, their buying behaviors really influences their overall body weight, their ability to manage their body weight, and then to potentially pursue any weight loss that could be potentially inhibited by issues related to food insecurity. People who are lower resource, they may not be able to actually visit Pennington to participate in a study. Bringing recruitment, at least to them, enables us to actually reach those people in a more effective way. Finding key mentors in your area who can provide you with the information and the training that you need to effectively carry out a research study, to develop a research idea, to submit a grant, all of that's so important. And having a mentorship team is what's most important. It's nice to have a mentor who has that perspective to lend that knowledge as I carry out community-based research projects. I'm currently what we call a Roadmap Scholar, and this Roadmap Scholar Award is funded by the LACATS program, the Louisiana Center for uh, Clinical and Translational Science. The LACATS Center, obviously, the focus is on Louisiana and health disparities within Louisiana. So the research that I'm doing and the opportunity provided by LACATS uh, fit very well together, and I'm very honored to be a part of LACATS, and I think what they're doing for Louisiana, but as well as young researchers as myself, um, is extremely important.